Hello everybody, um, this video I'm going to show you how to connect your Oana broker to TradingView. So first we'll need a account to connect to TradingView. You can skip this part if you already have an account, but for tutorial's sake, I'm going to start from account creation. So on Oanda, here is a demo. I'm on the demo account. I'm going to create a new account for tutorial's sake. Um, let's start with it doesn't really matter which one you pick. For account name, I'm going to do demo tutorial. Demo for YouTube tutorial. It, um, I'm just going to name it that. It doesn't really matter what you uh, name it. Currency, I'm in the United States. So USD. Leverage, for Awanda, you have the 50 to 1 leverage. With other brokers, um, if you are using like an unregulated broker, you can get up to like um, 500 to 1. But in this tutorial, we'll be using a regulated broker. And we'll press create to create the demo account for tutorial. Okay, now that we have the account created for the tutorial, I'm going to deposit virtual money into the demo account just so we can do, we can execute a trade later on when we connect it to TradingView um, for tutorial's sake. So we're going to deposit. To an empty four where's the demo for youtube tutorial right over here press continue add virtual funds continue and we'll just add three thousand for it could be anything it's not real money this is a demo account all right we'll wait until this is finished perfect back to accounts and I just want to confirm that the 3000 is in there for us to trade on TradingView. So demo for YouTube tutorial, we had 3000 Cool. So we can go back to TradingView. So this is like the home page for TradingView. Make sure you have an account on TradingView. You don't need a paid account. You can use a free version. Um, so on TradingView, you go to any pair click on any pair we're gonna pick on we're gonna click euro dollar and all you want to do is click on see super charts this is going to bring you to the chart view and on the chart view you'll go to the very bottom where it says trading panel you'll click on a trading panel and then trading view will show you the list of brokers that they support on their platform so right now they have Tradier, Oanda, Forex.com, Webull, um, the regulated broker. So if you're using an unregulated broker like Hugo's Way or KLT Forex, they're not going to be here right now. Um, so in this case, we have Oanda. Um, right before we get in there, um, if you don't have a broker yet, just make sure you guys do your due diligence. I'm not going to tell you which brokers that you should have like sign up for. Um, Please just do your own research. If you guys are using an unregulated broker, make sure you know the risks of using an unregulated broker. And if you guys are using a regulated broker, obviously the leverage is going to be lower, but it's just going to be safer. Anyways, going back to Awanda, we will be selecting Awanda because that's where our demo account is in. It's going to give you the option of live or demo. For this tutorial, I'm going to do demo. Um, I check this box, press connect. <clears throat> and once this loads, it will show you the accounts that we have. Um, for this, we will be selecting demo for YouTube tutorial, the um, account, and then we'll press allow. Obviously, you can connect all four, but we're just going to be connecting the one that we made previously or earlier from Oanda. And once it's finished um, connecting, on the very bottom now, you'll see that the demo has been connected. And once you click on that, on the top corner right here, this is how much we added in earlier, the 3000 which is available for trading. Again, this is a demo account, so it's not going to be real money. Um, this is just for a tutorial so you have positions orders account summary transaction history your log okay not much going on over here for 
the tutorial say let's place a trade order so i'm going to place a market order i'm going to do a 0 0.01 lot which is equivalent to 10,000 units 0 0.1 yeah 0 0.1 lot which is equivalent to 10,000 units um take profit uh let's take profit i'm going to do 0 0.8 right over here 0 0.9 which is equivalent to 37.9 pips. Stop loss, 0.84, we'll do that. For tutorial sake, we'll do, and margin use is $218, we'll sell. Once you place a sell order, it's gonna show you your stop loss, your entry point right over here, and your take profit. Again, this is not a trade that I'll be placing, but for um, demonstration purposes, that will be, that's how you use it. And if you pull up the bottom screen, it's going to show you your positions. So units, 10,000 units, or 0 0.01, 0 0.1. I keep messing that up. We're shorting this. This is where we entered. This is the current price. This is how much we're down in US dollars. This is the profit in pips, so we're down two we're down three pips right now. And this is how much we're down um, based on the percentage of the account balance. And that is it for the tutorial. Oh, and this is how you close it. So if you if I wanted to close it, um, you have the option to partial close if it's greater than a thousand units. So let's do let's partial close. And now you have, we partial closed, we uh, closed half the position. If you want to close a full position, all you got to do is deselect partial close and close the whole position. And you'll see your transaction history. In your account summary, your orders. Yep, and that's it for the video.